What's up guys and welcome to another video on the channel. It's Sunday, it's what well, should be a decent content day. It's Halloween. Um, sorry I'm not dressed up. Um, not that any of you probably would want to see me dressed up in anything weird. But we have got some content for today. We uh, were probably expecting something considering the fact that yesterday they brought out the mini release. So today they have brought out two SBCs it would seem like. Dante, centre back from um, Nice, Brazilian of course, in Ligue 1. He is going to cost you a common gold squad, a rare gold squad, a Ligue 1 team of 82 rated, a Ligue, well, Ligue 1 player with 82 rated and 80 chem, um, a Brazilian player with 83 rated squad and 75 chem, an 84 rated squad with 70 chem, and then an 85 rated squad with 65 chem now um i mean he has got a massive increase for his pace because i think dante i think his normal pace is around about in the 40s um so that is well, that's, that's terrible let's face it um but this card actually looks really really decent low high work rates three star four star a lot of people, I think, used to used to like this player when uh, I think a fair few FIFAs ago, to be honest. But when he actually did have um, some pace, but I don't know. I think that's a bit that's a bit expensive. You can go out and get yourself Kempembe or or Marquinhos, unless of course you're playing a five at the back, which you're going to need three centre backs for. That's when you may consider. Wanting to have this Dante in your squad. I mean, it would have been nice if there was uh, maybe two different versions of him. It is just the one version, unfortunately. But there's that. And then there's Night Fright. Can't probably say Fright Night because that's the name of a, uh, a movie series. And <laughs> they may get sued. Who knows? But uh, players from the same league, Max Free. <clears throat> player quality minimum silver. Gold players minimum eight. Rare players minimum four. Uh, and there's, of course, the centre spot taken from the centre back. So pretty much use um, all from the same league, really. No, sorry, not league. Uh, the same country. Uh, Spanish is usually the one I've got the most out of. So let's try and do that. Hopefully, we should have enough rares, I'd, I'd imagine. Yeah, I mean... Pedri and Sola can come in there. And Soldado and Paco Alcacer. He's going to go at the cam position. Rodrigo can go in the cam position. Oh, I'm... there's me saying to myself, don't use too many people from the same league. And then I start doing it, don't I? So, right, Angelina there. Um, we we'll have to use Aspen Aquera in this one. I know it's a bit expensive. Um, we obviously are playing over the top for what this is. But, hey ho. And then again, we could probably get away with that over the other one. Let's try and figure out. Let's go silver and see what we've got from silver. Aha, we've got Adrian. From Liverpool, he could go in there. And then take this guy as the right back from over there. We just need one more silver player. Sorry, one more gold player, I should say. To uh, fill the rest of this out. Which would be Cesc Fabregas. And that is done. And we're going to open this as part of the uh, our reward pack opening, which is going to be in this same video, which we're going to get to in a second. We finished rank two again, scraped it right on the last game. It was a very difficult weekend this weekend. Um, I don't know what was wrong with the gameplay. I just felt it was... And I'm probably thinking most people probably feel like this most of the time, but it just felt like it was against me, uh, a good portion of it. Um, but, hey -o, that's what happens. Uh, we always get these bad weekends. It's about getting through it. 
But it doesn't look like we've got any new objectives done by uh, EA. It would have been nice if there would have been another Halloween themed one, maybe. But we move. Right, we're going on to open our packs then. Just make sure the uh, monitor doesn't turn off there. Now, it's going to go into my picks. So we're going to start off with the red picks first. We are obviously hoping for one person. We are hoping for Mohamed Salah. We are hoping for the man who scored a hat-trick at Old Trafford. The only person to ever do so in the Premier League and English football. Obviously, uh, R9 managed to do one there back in, I think, the early 2000s. But, um, yes, the only one to do it in the Premier League. So we're hoping for him. If we can get him, it will be an amazing day. So let's open it now. Let's go hope. Oh, we do get... I mean, oh, that's actually a really decent decent selection of picks. The only issue there, of course, is that Smith Rowe is probably the one I'll take. Because Alaba, I've already got his ones to watch. Uh, that would have been a brilliant choice if we didn't already have the ones to watch. And Tadic there as well. He isn't bad, but I'm going to take Smith Rowe. I'm going to see what this guy could be like in a, an all-English team, maybe. Maybe we'll get Salah on this one. You never know. Oh, we get Mason Mount. I'll take Mason Mount, that's for sure. I mean, Declan Rice, of course, was another decent choice there. But I'll take Mason Mount. And then last but not least. Oh, yes. Actually, this has been a very good red pick uh, selection. This has got Upa Mancano. Don't have his ones to watch. And he'll be really good to have. When we start doing icon swaps. So I'm actually really happy with the uh, the team of the week selection that we've got uh, so far. So that's not bad. Let's go and have a look to see what we've got. So the streaming team of the week pack, the Jumbo Rare Players pack and the uh, the Mega pack is what we've got from our rewards from Foot Champs. The rest has been gathered from being terrible in the draft again. Uh, nothing from the first pack. We've got French. Ah, that doesn't matter. Gigo. Uh, yeah, being terrible to draft, getting knocked out very early on. Um, not <laughs> just, I think we got. I didn't. Don't think we got knocked out too early on. I think we got knocked out just uh, in the semi-finals, and that's about as bad as they can get. I think it was the Jumbo Premium Gold Pack was the other one that was part of that. And the Jumbo Premium Gold Pack doesn't get us anything. It's really hard to make coins now uh, in. The uh, in the draft, it's a really difficult game mode to play. A lot of a lot of people have been saying it's far harder to win the draft this year. I've only done it, I think, six times so far. So, which is still decent, but you know you could do be better. You could be doing better, right? This is the premium gold players pack that we got from doing the uh, night fright. SBC. Let's see if there's anything decent coming out of this. Oh, we do pack ourselves the right midfielder from Preston. Um, why is it that this guy got himself a card? I do not know. It, it just baffles me. Lots of other choices, and he gets one. And I've packed him twice now. Oh, dear. But, I mean, I don't know if he's worth anything. He's probably not. I mean, he's worth about 15k, maybe 14. We'll, we'll see if anyone, someone wants to buy him for 14. Maybe there's a Preston fan out there. <laughs> but apart from that, that's pretty terrible. Right, we're going to open our Mega Pack first from our rewards then. Start off with this and hopefully we'll get something. Oh, we get another walkout and it's Tony Cruz. The two walkouts are ready. Not bad at all. We've obviously got the Jumbo Rare Players Pack to go. Hopefully something amazing comes out of that. Anything else in this dangler? Not really. We get Asper Laqueta. Maybe there's something that we've got already uh, as a dangler. We do get a Shadow card and they're worth 4.5k. Uh, no, James Rodriguez and Cochrane. And I'm just about to rid of the Shadow card. Don't want to do that. Right then. The Jumbo Rare Players Pack, I actually think it's probably better to open the Premium Team of the Week Pack um, next, but no, 
because we're probably not going to get anything decent out of it. But here we go. Jumbo Red Players Pack. Give us something decent. Oh, yes. It's the team of the week. Oh, it's, oh, it's Mason Mount. It is Mason Mount. I'm not sure how much he's going for. But obviously, we've already got his red pick. So let's hope there's something hiding behind this. Oh, it's a it's a Kilo Navas, cheeky Kilo Navas, but that's a pretty a bit of a dead pack, really. How much is? Uh, yeah, see, Mason Mount's price is very very low. It's about 15k, if that. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll get rid of possibly. Let's see who can go up here. We'll get rid of Rodriguez on up here, and Mason Mount can go up there. Uh, everyone else can pretty much go. Wow. A lot of duplicates there. Worth 8,000 coins though, so that's not bad. Really was hoping for something better. But maybe Mo Salah. We, this is the last chance we've got to get Mo Salah. Technically, I mean, obviously, he's still available in packs until next week's Team of the Week. But let's hope we can try and get him in this. Here we go. Nope. You can tell by the small walkouts. Unfortunately, it is colored car, and I've already got him. So this is going to be 30,000 coins worth of trash. Yep. Off they go. 30,000 coins worth of trash. That is going to be the end of the video, guys. I hope you will join us for the next one. And if you did like the video, please leave a like. If you do fancy coming back to watch more, do consider subscribing. And I shall catch you next time. Bye-bye.